Sun Devil fans, in the theme of our salute to service today, please join me in welcoming Lieutenant Colonel Mr. Scott Morley in here today. Scott, you were a Green Beret since 2006. Here you are in salute to service day. How cool of an event is this for you? Could not be happy to be here today. The connection between Arizona State University and the United States Army goes long, far and wide. Not only Pat Tillman, most people don't know that Ray Anderson, the athletic director, his cousin was a first African American to win the Medal of Honor and he did it in Vietnam to save his team. President Michael Crow is the son of a Navy sailor. Right now, today on the ground, we have members of 2nd Battalion, 75th Ranger Regiment. We have the Black Daggers jumping in Old Glory. We, we have the 160 Special Operations Aviation Regiment parked a Black Hawk right there at Sparky's tailgate. Super cool. Arizona State has one of the largest veteran student populations in the entire country. This whole week has been outstanding. It really is, and it's a special day today. It's great to have you and really everything that we've got here today. But I know for you, it's much more than just today, and you're much more than just being a Green Bray. You're also a part of community outreach and getting people into the Army and getting people awareness of how great the Army can be for you. What, what is that like? So, proof positive. I have an Ivy League bachelor's. I have an Ivy League master's degree, all because the Army paid for it, right? So what most people know, don't know is that every single one of the Army's 150 different jobs are open to both men and women. Less than 29% of America's youth qualify for military service, only 1% serve. We don't take everybody, but those who do serve do it absolutely pride of this nation. We're paying for master's degree. You need a master's degree, you can go through the RTC program. You, need a, you want to get your doctorate and go into medicine? Right now, the Army's paying for a quarter of a million dollars in medical school scholarships. More men and women need to know about the opportunities that a life in the military provides. And you just said the pride of this country and for every current and former military member in here and all their families, what do you have to say to them? Two things. You can visit YouTube and look for What's Your Warrior? But to all the families and the service members who have served, Thank you very much for your service. Happy Veterans Day. Forks up. Beat USC. <laughs> Lieutenant Colonel Scott Morley, thank you for your service. Thank you. Thanks for the time.